Come on. Got him. That's a big fish, Mike. That is a big fish. All right, y'all. We are home, sweet home, back in Tennessee. Hope you guys are enjoying the Alabama videos. Now we're back on local waters. We're here on Cherokee Lake. I'm gonna uh, get on some brush pile fishing. See if we can hook into some massive crappie. Stay tuned, y'all. We're about to have some fun. I have one looking at it already. All right. Catch him, brother. Catch here he comes. <laughs> Got him. Net, please. That's a big fish. <laughs> you got him? Yes. Oh, big old female. Look at that. <laughs> okay, Mike, I'm going to give you what I have if you want to. If I catch another one, I'm going to give you what I just did. All right, y'all. That, is, that is a big, massive female. And she's still, she still got a full stomach. Yes. That's a beauty. Okay, there we go. There's number one. Yay. I watched her come off the brush. Yeah, so, guys, old, what we did there. Those are all crappie, guys. As we all threw that. the Mardi Gras crappie magnet Beautiful. with the pink jig head. Beautiful. Let's get a uh, Mike. Thank you for putting me on the spot, brother. You're welcome. We are sitting at she's 14, 13 and three quarters, yep. and she absolutely slammed it. Okay, we're gonna try this again. Turn them out. Get another one. There's some bigger ones on the bottom too. They're in there. Here he comes, here he comes. Got him. Got him. Net, please. Oh, that's a bigger fish. That's a way bigger fish. Oh, oh. There you go. Got myself in the net. Oh, my goodness. That's a nice, beautiful crappie. Beautiful. Okay, Mike, Absolutely you want to get rigged beautiful. up this way? I got the. I got all the gear you need. Yeah, keep going. I'm just going to Guys, there's number two. Mike came out here with Jeff and, the, and my sister, his wife, the crappie queen, and... Uh, they wore them out, and Mike says, hey, you got to get out here with me and go fishing on the spot. I think I found the crappie, guys, and uh, he definitely found the crappie. That is two. That was cool. I watched it come out and smack it. This one Another is 12, 12 inches. I one. Okay, guys, so what you've been seeing so far is we've been live scoping them. This is kind of a look at the brush that we have in there, and you can see some of the fish swimming around in there. We're going to show you a quick and simple method of how we are going to get on these fish and catch a few real fast using a variety of colors. And there's more of them down there, y'all. Look at this. That is what we're looking at. Here we go. I'm gonna cast out there again. Now what I'm doing is I'm casting past them just a little bit and letting it come down in a natural presentation back through them. I'm using the live scope and I'm waiting to feel for the thump. That sure. Makes sense. See, there it comes. There it is, yep. There's several of them following it. Got him? Oh, missed him. Oh. That was a smaller bite, y'all. That was a smaller bite. Here we go. Oh, yeah, look at them. So the ones that came out just went back mm -hmm. in. All right, y'all, here's what I'm using. I'm using a 16th ounce pink Arky jig head and a crappie magnet in the Marty Raw color. This I'm is surprised awesome. surprised they're hitting as well as they did in the middle of the day like that. I'm not. They got to feed. They got to feed. You guys are wondering why these professionals and they're, they're not sick coming out and telling you why they're doing it are going bigger on the jig heads and all that because they can't see anything on the live scope unless you have the really nice live scope. So all you got to do instead of going out and spending thousands of dollars and buying the upgraded live scope, you get yourself a bigger split shot and come up about 8, 12 inches above it so that it doesn't spook the fish. And then you go get them. Man, they're holding tight to the tree. Oh! Come on, he's coming. Oh, two of them swiped at it, and then they didn't take it. Come on. I'm right on the Come brush. On. I'm on the brush. Oh, they are holding so tight to that tree. I mean, they are holding tight. But see, they got me right at the top of that tree. Yeah. That's the oh, I, oh, I got it loose. Got him? Oh. Nope, I got it loose. That's what makes it so tough. Oh, here, I'm going to get him again. Now, what I'm noticing, though, is there's a big one right on the side of this bush, this branch right here. When you could get live scope to work, as far as them hitting, yeah. and you can watch it, it's fun. Well, if you had 20 brush piles to drive around and pick them off, that's the way to do it. Right, we don't, we unfortunately. Don't. Look at that, guys. That is a big old sturgeon. 
or a big old uh, paddlefish. Paddlefish. That thing is massive. <laughs> oh! Swiped at it? Yeah, whatever that big thing was. Don't tell me that was a crappie. That thing was massive. I bet it was a smallmouth. You gotta remember, smallies like to hang out on this brush. A couple of times I thought it was a big crap. It is a massive smallmouth. Oh, there's a lot of fish down here. Yes, there we go. There is. He's following it. Come on. He followed it out. That one's coming for it. Oh, there's like a bunch of them. A lot of they crap. came out, but they just didn't stick with it. Yep. See, I went to a white and a clear. I might just need to go back to the Mardi Gras. Falling down right there. They're chasing it. Come on, there's like four of them following it. Got him. Nice. That's a big fish. Oh yeah, that's a big, oh my goodness. Oh, that's a beautiful one. Oh yes. Yes. That's another black crappy dude. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Guys, we're catching them every way from Sunday. Check that out. Absolutely beautiful. On the crappie magnet. Yes. <laughs> yep, we're doodles. All oh, right, that's what I'm talking about, brother. Let's check this one out. This one is 13 and a half inches. All right, guys, you knew we were not going to have a fishing video without me coming home and catching another elusive snag fish. Look at that, y'all. Oh, you got it. All right. Yeah, well, I am the king of catching the snag fish. You know, a lot of people could claim a lot of things, but I don't think anyone can lay claim to my title as the elusive snag fish king. No. That is just that beautiful massive, right there. Uh... All right. There we go, y'all. Enjoy that one. It, that's how we do it. Here we go. Come on, hit it. Got him. Got him? Net, please. That's a big fish. Oh, yeah. He's gone. That's a keeper. Huh. Right on that side of the brush. That's 11 inch all day long. Oh, so. yeah. There we go, guys. <laughs> Back to the spot and boom. Come here. I have never caught this many fish using my scope before. Oh no. Nine and seven eighths. Really? Not yep. quite ten, huh? Nope. Oh. Either way, beautiful catch. Go get bigger. Now I was watching them here and I was like, well, I said I can't quite get to them where I'm at. So why don't I cast like this, right? So I went and I could watch it fall in here. There it goes. It's falling down. It's falling down. Kind of in that cradle where they are. Here we go. Oh, he's following it out. Got no one following it. Come on, catch him. Bigger one just came out. Oh, the bigger one came out. It looked like he ate the fish that was following my jig. <laughs> he's like, hey, thanks. Been trying to eat that little guy all day. There's a big crappie right there. It's what I'm trying to get, but it's more like over here. Oh, I missed him. He's, Look, he's right he there. That was a good one, too. Yep. There they are. Right on top of him now. Come on. That would have been Got him. Got him? Yep. Right. <laughs> <laughs> well, y'all. You got him. I got him. <sighs> that was That's awesome. Here I'm getting the net, and you're not yelling for a net. <laughs> well, because I'm like, I got him. I know I got him because I felt the thump, but... Ain't feeling very big. Ain't feeling very big. Guys, this is uh, it's becoming quite the learning experience, and I'm enjoying it. It is being fun. It's fun when they bite. Well, when you can actually see it, because look, I know where I need to drop down on them, and I figured out how to cast there. And I'm trying to pick them off off the top like you're supposed to. Let's see, I'm going to drop down because there's a bigger one, right? That's the one I want. I need that one to chase it. He's following it. Following it. Catch him. 
I missed them. Well, they're being kind of timid, Mikey. <laughs> Not missing them. They just watch grandma. They just watch grandma and grandpa get destroyed. Got him. Got him. Oh, I think he got me around a branch. He did. Look. Yep. I got him, and he got me around a branch. There's my fall. Oh, here he comes. Oh, he came out. He looked at it. Come on. Got him. That's a big fish, Mike. That is a big fish. That might be a small male. That's a massive crappie. Here. Dude, that's a hog. That's freaking hot. It's another black crappie. <laughs> Brother. Dude, you're wearing them out. This is the best you've ever done on life. Ever. 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 Look at that, y'all. Change colors. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. That's what I'm talking about. That is a... 13 and a quarter. Yeah, those, those are, are crappy. crappy. That's probably and they're, swear that's what I But saw they're at 16 up. feet. Oh, they're that deep. Oh. Yeah, that's what I'm seeing. It's 16 feet. Just by stopping. Here we go. Come on. Oh. See, look. See him right there? He turned around and went back. Those are crappy. I want that fish right there. That's a big fish. Got him. Oh, yeah. Net, net. He followed it all the yes, way up to the top. got him. <laughs> it's another, it popped right out he, of his mouth. He followed it. That's that, another 12 inch, brother. The crappie nibbles what got him, guys. He followed that one. Remember, I kept saying he keeps falling all the way up to the top. Wanted nothing to do with it. He finally hit it. A big one just came up right there. Dude, they're still in there. Holy crap. I'm following. You okay? Yeah. Guys, that is a 12 and a half incher. Guys, what's your opinion on live scope fishing? Do you like it? Do you think it's cheating? But here's one thing, we're fishing. So technically anything could be deemed cheating. Got one fall on it, come on. Commit, come on, come on, come on. Come on, got him. Yes. <laughs> but I got him. Guys, they're not all gonna be monsters. But that is how you live scope for crappie. Cast after cast after cast. Change your presentation, change colors, change your reeling depths or speeds. That was one of the hardest fish I've ever worked for in my life. And it wasn't even a monster. But it's, there's, it's got a brother and sister down there that are like three times its size. Got another one following it. Got him. That's a better fish. Nope. <laughs> well, y'all, you just saw that. That's two in a row with live scope. The bite's turning on, but I'm not getting any big ones here. Still a beautiful fish. I changed to that uh, kind of like a stump bug or a grub of some sort, and they are hitting it. Okay, looking for the bigger ones. I got two big crappie following this. Got him. Got him? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Ooh, I that is why I kept throwing in there, guys. Yes. <laughs> that is why I was like, I'm not giving up. Look at that. that beautiful. That's what we're talking about. I kept watching them. I'm like, I'm going to just keep throwing them. They go, they're going to. That's why we keep throwing in there. That is live scope fishing at its best. And if you look, there ain't no shortage. Oh, my goodness. Another 12, 12 inches. inches. This is, I'm not even gonna, I'm, I'm, guys, this is just the best crappie fishing I've ever had, like in one outing. Hey y'all, well, we hope you enjoyed this video of live scope fishing. No matter how you like to get out and go fishing, get out, go fishing and have fun. Remember, it's your preference and how you wanna fish. We're just trying to show you a few ways that we enjoy fishing. We'll see you again soon on the next cast. Mm -hmm.